Let's start. This is day one of the roof project where I will replace the entire waterproofing of the house. So, baseline are the beans and on top of it there is a wooden, there are wooden boards and on top of that I have something like 40 centimeters of um, um, of straw bales and on top of the straw bales I have let's see a layer of, of geotextile that I use to protect the waterproofing membrane uh, waterproofing membrane that it's a PVC membrane and then on top was um, another geotextile that was meant to um, protect the waterproofing from the earth that was coming on top of it something similar to here you can see the geotextile you can see the earth and underneath this is the waterproofing no not here the waterproofing the geotextile and the straw bells. i managed to to cut the grass around the around the roof and now i will start uh, uncovering the straw bales so i can take them off and after that we'll apply um, a layer of i forgot the name again of whatever a bitumen a liquid bitumen and then the the bitumen membrane the first layer I removed the a small area in order to show you how and why I'm taking off this. As you can see in some areas, uh, the straw bales are dry. In some way areas, the straw bales were wet and this is why they are dark. And in some areas, they are actually completely destroyed and there is a hole and you can use this directly as compost because as you can see it's completely uh, destroyed so probably part of this is because of water damage from um, the waterproofing that was not correctly glued um, and part is because of condensation under the PVC membrane but regardless this must come off entirely and we'll see how it will look
this is it. This is a big straw bale. It was something like 40, I think, by 90, by 120. And I'm extracting them one by one. You can see the, how they look on the inside and how the top layer is completely damaged in some places. In others, it's okay. This was the um, chimney, like that one, but I took it out. And in here is the beginning of a nightmare because I have to pile them somehow and it will take a lot of space but we are going to do it The pile is growing, so I managed to, to eliminate the straw bales from the top of the uh, bathroom. And in order to do the same, ooh, over the, this is a bedroom and this is another bedroom. And unlike the rest of the roof, in this area, I managed to cover uh, it with uh, earth. In order to get rid of the earth, I have to take out the um, um, earth bags that I put on the side in order to prevent the rain from washing uh, the earth. So all around, I have... Um, a bag put side by side with um, filled with earth that now as you can see it's very hard to uh, detach but this, the earth bag is only until here so the rest of it I have to shovel it I have another something like probably four bags and I'll be able to, I'm tired. I have to start in the morning. Today I prepared the, the space around the house. So I worked during the day, so it was hot. So I only started in the evening, but I was already tired from the heat of the day. So tomorrow we'll work from very early on when it's like now, no sunshine, only yellow flowers. So I'll continue a little bit with this and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.